<laughs> so you miss the narcissist? What do you miss exactly? The lying, the cheating, them stealing from you, you know, um, gaslighting you, thinking, causing you to think that like, you know, you're slowly losing your sanity, um, abusing you by just doing things and saying things to get a reaction. They love, you know, seeing you off. They love seeing you off balance. They love taking you off balance. You know, they love seeing you angry, sad, depressed, all these other things. You think they truly want you to be happy? They pretend to be who you want them to be. And then it's hard for you to let go of what they pretended to be. So now where they actually take off their mask and show you who they truly are, you absolutely cannot believe who this is. And you're like, oh my God, you changed. They didn't change. That's who the hell they are. So tell me again why you miss them. They are not a loss. It is a gain to walk away. It is a gain to never speak to them a day in your life again. Trust me, you're not missing out on anything. When they say they miss you, oh yeah, they miss you all right. They miss lying because they're pathological habitual liars. Yeah, they love abusing you because, hell, they don't even love themselves. They hate themselves. So now, to keep from feeling the hatred for themselves, they spew their venom and their poison by projection and putting it off on you. Because they can't regulate their emotions. They're incapable of self-reflection. You know what I'm saying? They criticize you and down you and belittle you and make you feel so small. You realize what you're not missing when you get rid of them. You realize how much you have to gain in life without them. They truly deep down inside need you more than you will ever need them. But they don't want you to know that. They want you to think that you can't survive without them. That's just how they are. They actually think, how dare you actually elevate your life, be happy and successful without me that is their mindset y'all like narcissistic toxic people like when you see them for who they are believe it and move accordingly i'm not gonna tell you what to do in your life you are the ceo or the president of your life promote and demote people accordingly accept and reject people accordingly you know i understand if you have a well you know i don't want to hurt their feelings did they give a damn about your feelings when they did the disrespectful things that they did said the disrespectful things that they said the disrespect is all the closure you need like for real so i mean i can understand you miss them you miss the fake personality that they showed you who they are you miss that fake personality but now it's time to accept the reality of the real them which is now exposed out in the open because once they show you their true face there's no going back unless you want to be breadcrumbed unless you want them dangling the carrot in your face you know unless you want to be begging and pleading for basic you know respect basic you know needs attention love affection whatever it is you know we're too old you know to be telling another person how to treat you and it's okay to forgive them forgive them because you have the ability to forgive they're never forgiving they're unforgiving everything that you do and half the time it's a lot of stuff that you may say or do and you don't even know you did or said something that flipped a switch in their twisted mind that got them wanting revenge and it's like what look you can't explain the irrational you know what i'm saying you can't explain lunacy you know they have a lot of magical thinking they get thoughts in their heads and they just start running with it you know they probably be talking to their demons or some shit i don't know what goes on in their head but we all know one thing they are crazy but they love to try to make you seem crazy but if you know you're not crazy you know, everybody else is saying the same thing about them. You notice that they don't really have no friends. 
you know, they don't really have long-term relationships with their family, with their friends, with anyone. Just people that they claim are their friends. And then behind closed doors, they're talking about them. You know what I'm saying? Gossiping back and forth. Telling you, oh, yeah, this, that, and the third. Then they go to that person and talk about you. These people, they love strife. They love division. They love chaos. They love drama. They love destruction. They kill, steal, and destroy everything. So if you truly want to live a happy, productive, successful, and a life with love and everything that you truly, truly want, get rid of the narcissist or toxic person in your life. Trust me when I tell you, you're not missing out on anything. They're going to miss you because they miss what you were doing for them. They miss the benefits that you gave them. You know what I'm saying? So tell me again why you miss them.